the way we're working now in fashion, it's somehow on an end of an era. People are trying to find new ways, and I think that's super positive. Hey, I'm Duran Lanting. I'm a fashion designer based in Amsterdam. During my master's, I found it so sad that all these beautiful pieces were just laying around. So I started making all these collages to create something unique out of it. My school hated it. They wanted me to create everything in new materials, which I strongly disagree with. So I think repurposing old stock is the new way forward. Everybody needs to find his own way of building a more supportive and a more positive future. There's so much stuff laying around in the world and so much beautiful pieces as well. Literally everything what I do within fashion is always sustainable. It's a modern mindset. It's just my way of working. The idea is that we reuse everything. So everything that we get goes back into a design. People sometimes think it's DIY. It's absolutely not. So it's like a constant puzzle. You're just constantly thinking how to make it perfect. That's the most challenging part about reusing old materials. How can you make this more beautiful than it already was? In the studio, we do a zero waste policy. We recreate everything and we reuse everything as well. We reuse the zippers, reuse the threads, everything. I always end up cutting things out of my own closet as well. Making collage books was like the core of how I started. Cutting up subcultures and then combining them. So you have like a gothic here and then there's a rich grandma over here. And like a motor queer guy underneath. So that's like the whole starting point of me cutting up clothes. Literally, these are my Bibles. So kind of a cliche, I think, because all designers have collage books. Every day I have a new concept, I still open these books. The first step of coming to London was going to the warehouse of Browns. When I'm looking at these reels of clothing, I start making collages in my head. The pieces can be worn by anyone. Whoever feels like to wear it should wear it. There was a green PVC jacket that like directly caught my eye. Yeah, I was so happy with it. I was already trying to redesign it. I do try to change the pieces, but they have to sort of speak for itself. So what inspires my work is being free. In my studio, we have a team of seven girls and one guy. Each person is a specialist in what they do. We're sort of working towards being a family because it's all new. Mainly the technique is, of course, cutting up. We're always trying to find new ways to connect linings or make new linings, new techniques to make the inside beautiful because that's the hardest thing of cutting things up. This dress was kind of nice to work on. It was a lot easier than the coats. So we deattached the whole souvenir jacket and used only the details. So this detail is the neckline of the souvenir jacket. I like the way of combining like sportswear with a really feminine dress. In the future, we do want to grow. So we need to find a way to large the scale of designs, but we're figuring out how. It's all depending on the stock that's left. What I've been taught in the academy years is that it's always important to refresh yourself. It's just important that a person feels good and free in the pieces we create. This collection will be exclusive for Browns. It's taking six weeks of 24-7 work. There are 45 pieces. It's a complete mashup. Seeing the end results, I'm really happy. Yeah, the only way forward, I think, is to recreate literally everything. Thank you.